Well, Hidden Valley Advent Animal Adventure is ready to reopen their doors tomorrow, and this will be the 14th season for the company that provides safari tours. To tell us more about that is General Manager Barb Dominizzi. Thank you so much for, for stopping here today. Thank you for having me. So we have Wilma and Winston here. They are so beautiful. Tell us a little bit about that. So Wilma is two weeks old, and Winston's a week and a half. Um, they both um, were born with their moms, but um, their moms weren't able to take care of them and feed them, so now they're bottle babies. Oh, so. they are loving all of the attention. This is so <laughs> great. So tell us a little bit about, this is your 14th season, so very exciting coming up this weekend. So for people who are interested, what do you guys do? We offer uh, safari tours through the park. Uh, you can take the safari bus, it's a guided tour, or you can drive your own car through the park, which is, and the two very different tours. Uh, on the safari bus, you're feeding animals up above the animals, and in the car, they're right down with you oh, wow. on ground level. So an animal could sneak its head in, right into your car, and the zebra like to um, stick their head in, and you can feed them, and you can actually touch them too. Oh my gosh, how fun is that? What kind of animals do you guys have? We have, out in the park, we have uh, camels, zebra, uh, lots of cattle. We have Brahmas, Belted Galloway, Texas Longhorn. There's an ostrich, emus, uh, elk, bison. We just had our fourth bison baby this season. A little white one was born this past week. Oh my gosh. So the babies are already arriving. So many babies, including the ones we have here. <laughs> uh, so people who are interested, how can they, how can they sign up for a tour, either uh, the car one or the safari? They can go online at hiddenvalleyadventure.com and book online. For the buses, we, re we highly recommend they do it in advance. Okay. Uh, we're still hiring bus drivers, but uh, so there's limited buses available. But that's the best way to ensure that they have a seat. Uh, if there's seats available when they arrive on property, they could still um, book a seat when they get on property. And for the drive through you can purchase online in advance or when you come on site, that's fine too. It works both ways. Great, 14 years, that is such an exciting achievement. <laughs> How do you guys keep it going year after year? Well, it's the visitors, obviously, that keep us going. And um, people have a passion for animals. Our staff are very, they're, they're awesome. Um, we have many returning staff and, and they help take care of the animals during the off season. And obviously it's the people. If the people don't come, we can't stay open. So the people keep us going and um, 14th season, and we never really, really were sure that we would get here, but we're getting close to 15 and I agree. That's an achievement. That's awesome. Barb, thank you so much for joining us. Wilma and Winston, I'm gonna take you guys home with me. <laughs> Stay with us, Mike Saika is tracking Buffalo's most accurate forecast when we come back.